Hi, I'm Mary Rogers and I'm going to show you today how simple and easy it is to maintain your grind and brew coffee maker so that you get best tasting coffee possible. First and foremost, let's talk about the removable parts. First you have under your lid, you're going to press the little button here and open it. This is your grind chamber and has a lid. This is where you're going to put your whole beans before you make coffee. This needs to be um, cleaned and maintained every time you actually brew a pot. So you can do that by either washing it by hand and or putting it in the top rack of the dishwasher. Um, all of the removable parts for this coffee maker can go in the top rack of the dishwasher, including the carafe and the carafe lid. So next, this is your um, water filter holder. So um, after you prepare your filter, you're going to put it in here and um, you're going to close the lid and it goes right inside your coffee maker. Just um, put it in the slot that's right down there. And then once again, close your lid. So the next thing we're going to look at is um, in the side of your coffee maker here, there's a little button. You press it and it pops open the grinder basket. So what happens is when you grind your beans, they automatically get dispensed right into the grinder basket. This is removable. You just lift it up. It also comes with a permanent filter holder. If you prefer, you can use the paper filters. So when you grind your beans, it automatically gets dispensed in there. Once again, this should be washed every single time that you use your coffee maker. Once again, on the top rack of the dishwasher and or by hand. To maintain the exterior of your coffee maker, it's simple and easy. All you're going to do is use a little bit of um, a soft cloth, always a soft cloth, and mild soapy water. You can wipe it down the sides. The other thing that we recommend that you do is always be sure that um, you rinse out your um, carafe and also wipe down any drips or spills that may have come onto the heater plate. So once again, just dry that. It's really easy to do. Just make sure there's no drips or spills. Never use anything abrasive on the exterior of your coffee maker because it will scratch the surface. So the next thing I'm going to show you how to do is maintain the interior of your coffee maker. So basically where your water flows to make coffee. What you're going to do is I filled this carafe with um, clean cold water. And um, what's going to happen is you fill it two thirds of the way full with clean cold water. And what you're going to do is this happens to be vinegar. You can either add the vinegar directly to the carafe so that it's filled up all the way like so. Then what you're going to do is you're going to remember to take out the filter holder and um, filter because you don't want the vinegar running through that. So you're going to add the um, water and vinegar mixture into the reservoir directly. So after you do that, it couldn't be simpler, easily, easier. You're basically going to put on your coffee maker. You're going to turn off the grind off function because you don't need to use that. And then you're going to turn on the coffee maker. And what's going to happen is it's going to actually start brewing, going through the, a slow brew cycle. And it's going to clean out the interior of the machine. When it's done and it's completed, what you're going to do is then run another cycle of just plain cold water and then you're all set to enjoy your coffee.